kind of just give you your space and let you make your music without getting in the way. The engineer, he knew exactly what we wanted. He's just like, oh, just play for a while. I'm like, okay, keep playing. And then, and then he would be like, hey, come in and listen. I'm like, how did you know that's exactly what I wanted? This is like the perfect setup for a ridiculous night. People are gonna come, and if there's a handful of them that don't know you, they'll be like, holy f Tonight is gonna be special. Tomorrow morning, I'm gonna wake up with a big ass smile on my face, I know it. In September, Converse have the keys to 12 of the most iconic recording studios on the planet. And they're looking for emerging artists who want to write the next chapter of music history. Register now. Uh, do I enjoy recording? I, yeah, I love it. I, I record all the time and I record everything. It's just so exciting for a young band to be in a studio. It's the sort of, it's, it's the dream. Just allow yourself to be there. Don't reserve anything, you know, live in that moment and make the most of where you are, you know. Do your thing, make your own history. Chat. You say they never heard a nigga rhyme like this before They acting like they never ever heard a hit before You wanna sign me? Shit, I'm gonna need a little more Tryna make a little more like Michael Moore what? <laughs> when I heard I was recording with Mark Ronson, I was utterly shocked. I was silent for a couple of minutes, just trying to piece together exactly what that meant in my head. He's extremely talented. Working with someone like that, who's already a musician, who kind of knows what he is, you're just like an editor. You're like, okay, you've got these five ideas. This is the best one, I think. You should run with that one, you know? Yo, Dap. Hi, Ken. How you doing? Welcome to number two control room. I started to work in this building uh, when I was 16. It was where I got my start, where I learned everything. This place completely changed my life. I thought it would be interesting to build something with you playing keys yeah. and making something kind of influenced like a 70s Afrobeat thing, because you have that in your production. There's a lot of what you're about that we can put in the song. This is going to be great. Fascination in it all The way that they just can't control the temperature They say it's harmless teenage fun But in his head now she's the one She's oblivious When there's a petal in her hair Who's blaming him? Hey, I'm Brain Mix World And I'm over here at the 100 Club For the Converse Rubber Track Sample Workshop Today I'm going to teach you to get a notation from a sample, add a whole new vibe and feel to it. So the trick that I'm going to show you today is a metallic distortion tinfoil sound effect for vocals. In music there's no right answer. If it sounds good, it sounds good. Dom and Kai from Mount Kimby. I'm Kai. I'm Dom. We make electronic music. Music's definitely influenced by, um, you know, living in London for the last... 10 years, you know, it certainly had an effect on that. But then also just the kind of history of electronic music and where, where it's come from and stuff like that as well. And pop. Yes, and, pop and, and it's, all, it's all essentially pop music at the end of the day, yeah, as well. Where we both came from was like sample heavy music. You can hear something in, in some, the way somebody else has recorded something and it can start an idea, you know, and the library's um, incredible resource. I absolutely rinsed it, lot, yeah. <laughs> the trick I'm gonna show you today is how to get a nice big stereo sound from one guitar using two amps. How it works is I take the signal from my guitar into my pedal chain and it's just taking one output into one amp and the other into a different one. So this is the dry signal. And this is with tremolo and reverb.
fascination in it all The way that they just can't control the temperature They say it's harmless teenage fun But in his head now she's the one, she's oblivious When there's a petal in her hair Who's blaming him? Cause every